road trip in Arizona. Top two, Barry Bonds. Watch where Robbie Hammock sets up. Low and away. Casey Daigle. Oh, leaves it up. And Bonds puts it up. Number 672 is fourth home run in six games. That home run is 14th of the year. And the Giants are up 1-0. Top three, Michael Tucker. Day leaves it up again. Tucker's fourth. Daigle gave up four runs on five hits and four and two-thirds. It's two-nothing San Fran. Top seven, Tucker. Past former Red Sox great Shea Hillenbrand. A throw to third. <laughs> All right, this is stretch. A little dicey. Run comes in. Giants win 8-4. The San Francisco Giants have won 10 games in a row. Diamondbacks going the other way. They've lost 10 of their last 12, their worst May ever. Colorado at San Diego. Jason Jennings allowed at least three earned runs in 10 starts this season, and his ERA is over eight. He's caught down a run in the fourth. He gets Terrence Long, the former Hawaii winter leaguer with a little aloha. And then Khalil Green in the fifth, swing and sway like Sammy K. Jennings. Eight innings, one earned, four Ks. Rockies up 3-1, top seven, Mark Sweeney. The leadoff man, the single to the left, that scores Charles Johnson. Sweeney went three for four in the Rockies, snap an eight-game road losing streak with the 7-1 win. Cardinals continuing their seven-game road trip in Pittsburgh, where Lloyd's McClendon's Pirates have won just two of the last 12 home games against St. Louis. Third inning, Scott Rowland. Oh, you can't get any hotter than Scott Rowland right now off Chris Benson, his 13th of the year. His 53 RBIs lead the majors, Rowland three for four. Puts the Cardinals up 5-2, top six. They're loaded for Albert Pujols, who hits a two-run double. Benson racked for eight runs on 11 hits in five and two-thirds. The Cardinals win 8-3. St. Louis has won three of four on that seven-game roadie. New York and Philadelphia ESPN Hot List host Brian Kenny did the play-by-play -play on TV's Shadow Box during the rain delay. Who knew? What was going on? The bottom third. Mets up a run. Marlon Bird with the foul pop. Mike Piazza. Taking a day off from catching, flashing the love glove, getting the top play nominee. P Piazza did get eat up later. There was more rain later. Two hours and 27 minutes this time, 73 minutes the first time. You do the math. Top eight, three, two Mets, Mike Cameron. Seven for 63 in his last 18 games. Went one for four in this one, but it was a big one. And one run scores, two run scores, and the Mets win against Atlanta. He's 0-4 at the Ted. Bottom one, he gets Nick Green on the 0-2 pitch. Green called up from AAA Richmond last month. In the third, he's batting again against Hernandez, and it's a tough start for the rookie. Strikes him out the end. The end. He, he's up for the injured Marcus Giles. We go bottom seven, tied at two, two outs. They're going to intentionally walk Rafael for call to get to green, and, well, it's not how you start. It's how you finish. 60 career homers in five minor league seasons and one in the big leagues. They had to coax him out of the dugout for a curtain call. Said he'd never done one before. The Braves win it, 8-2. Royals Walt versus Greg Maddox. Astros Cubs at Wrigley Field. Chicago area vets rooting on their Cubbies. Umpires uh, Edward Jeans weather delayed the plane that was carrying their uniforms. Bottom five, Moises Salou. Two run shot is 13th. Alou three for four on Veterans Day. The Cubs are up three nothing. Maddox in a jam here in the seventh. Runner on third. Tying run at the plate. One out. Mike Lamb to Derek Lee. Oh, look at that. Maddox would have to leave, though, with a strained muscle on his right side. He does get the win. He allowed only one run on seven hits in six and two-thirds. Says he's okay. Shouldn't miss his next start. Kyle Farnsworth gets Adam Everett to end a threat. And then the ninth, Joe Borowski gets Everett. His ninth save in ten chances. Oswald gets the loss. Cubs win 3-1. Monday afternoon tilt between the Dodgers and Brewers. Bottom nine, Danny Kolb hadn't blown a save in 14 attempts this season. Gives up two runs, three hits, hits a man in the ninth. Rookie Jason Grabowski single ties this ball game. Top ten, Eric Gagne gave up a double and hit a batter before telling Bill Hall to sit. Ends the inning. Hall caved four times. Bottom ten. Jose Hernandez drew a leadoff walk from Dave Burba. Sacrificed and then scored the game winner. Cesar is tourist. Drives him home. Lakers take the series 4-2. Dodgers take the game 3-2. Just soloed to tie it. Sean Casey. Solos to untie it. Both off Tommy Phelps. Casey's second of the game. He went two for four. Batting a major league leading 394. Top seven. Reds have lost their lead. Ken Griffey's going to get it back for him. Three-run job off Justin Wayne. Junior's 10th of the month. 494 career. Passes Lou Gehrig on the all-time list. 9-7 since he Griffey said afterwards the Marlins handing out Souvenir World Series championship rings inspired him. Todd Jones inspired. Ramon Castro, Lenny Harris strikeout. Luis Castillo grounds out. Highlight over, jam over. 9-7. Reds. 
Twins opening a 13-game homestand with a first to four against Fred McGriff and the Devil Rays top two. He takes a bite on a crime as the DH career home run number 492 is first of the year. Crime Dogs first, in fact, since last September 2nd as 2-0 Rays. In the seventh, here's a Ray, Ray Sanchez. Foul into the crowd and, uh-oh, here's this guy. Watch it, man. There's a beverage here. Oh, nice. Actually, it's just an empty cup, but still. Bottom eight. Free beverage for that. Bases loaded for Doug Mankiewicz into the 4-6-3. Devil Rays win 7-3. Minnesota, they have issues. Twins have lost 8 of 11. Toronto at Seattle, first game of the 12-game homestand for the AL Worst 9 and 13 at home this season. Mariners, Josh Phelps, Jamie Moyer, Scott Spezia. Top play nomination at third base. Next batter is Bobby Estelea. He went 0 for 4 with 2 Ks. And uh, Spezio again, he's got a banned sand frog. They're no cheaper than therapy, that's for sure. Ichiro, by the way, had three hits to give him 50 in May. As you see Spezio again, he becomes the first player since Pete Rose to have two 50-plus hit months in his career. And the Mariners win it, 6-2. Orioles, Red Sox of Fenway making up an April 13th rain out. Rodrigo Lopez, bottom one, rings up Manny Ramirez. Oh, Manny bailing out, thought it would hit him. Bottom five, Lopez, same pitch to David McCarty, who was not happy with the call. Lopez struck out seven and five and a third. Top six, the struggling Derek Lowe, facing Luis Matos. Lowe, just the wheels have completely come off Derek Lowe. This is a double. Lowe struggling again, gave up seven runs on eight hits in five. It's three-nothing Orioles. Jeff Brantley, your thoughts. Derek Lowe had a tough time in the sixth inning today, but it wasn't because of his pitching. It was because of a blister, and he got a blister throwing his two-seam sinker with that thumb rubbing along that seam right there. He got a lot of blood on his thumb. He's really rubbing it on his pants. He stayed in the ball game. Two hitters, too long. A familiar theme in Boston. Lowe has now lost four of his last five decisions. Top six, Lenny DiNardo facing Brian Roberts with the bases loaded, and he unloads. Baltimore leading the American League with a 287 team average. They beat up on the Red Sox 13.